dedicated themselves to the Fall Rebel Athletic Programs. First of all, thank you, and to the folks that are with you on the field, the parents, grandparents, big brothers and sisters, the people who care about you and have made it possible for you to get this far. Your efforts and dedication to the Rebel Athletic Programs are much appreciated by the Highland Coaches, School Administration, and your community. Now let's begin our introductions. We will start with the Rebel Golf Program. First off, we have Madison, Maddie Harris. Her parents are Shannon and Eric, Eric Harris. She played for the Rebel Golf Team for four years. She qualified for state all four years and played in all four state tournaments and was the medalist runner-up in this year's Cougar Classic. Maddie has also been a statistician for the Rebel football sideline staff for the past five years. Thank you, Maddie. Ethan Blaylack. Ethan's parents are Donna and Stephen Overton. He played for the Rebel golf team for two years. And he qualified for and played in this year's 2013 state golf tournament. Thank you, Ethan. Charlie Floyd. Charlie is out there with his parents, Beth and Steve. He played for the Rebel golf team for four years. And he qualified for and played in this year's 2013 state golf tournament. Thank you, Charlie. Now it's time to make Coach Wiggins cry. The players gave me a script to read. It says, we would like to thank Coach Wiggins for the three dedicated years he spent coaching us. He could not have, or we could not have asked for a better man to spend our golf careers with. For our best and worst times, Coach has taught us and, and encouraged us to be the gentlemen of character and ladies. Coach Wiggins loves the game, loves his job, and most importantly, he loves his players. Our golf careers have been an experience we will carry with us for the rest of our lives. Thank you, Coach Wiggins, for everything you do for the community, the school, and the Rebel Golf Team. We love you. I second that. The Rebel Tennis Team. First off, we have Jordan Moore. His parents are April and Ricky Moore. He played for the Rebel Tennis Team for one year, and he played on this year's district runner-up team. Thank you, Jordan. Zach Rush. His parents are Misty and David Rush. He played for the Rebel Tennis Team for two years. He played on two district runner-up teams. And this year he placed fourth in singles in the district tournament and was chosen all conference. Congratulations, Zach. Jordan Thatch. His parents are Joanne Batson, Shane and Renee Thatch. He played for the Rebel Tennis Team for four years. He played on three district runner-up teams. In 2011, he took third place in district doubles. In 2012, he took third place in district singles. In 2013, he was runner-up in district singles and took fourth place in this year's state tournament. Jordan was selected all-conference in 2011, 12, and 13 in all-state in 2013. Congratulations, Jordan. Chloe Sellers. Chloe's parents are Carol and Marty Sellers. She played for the Rebel Tennis Team for four years. She has played on one district championship team and three district runner-up teams. In 2010, she placed third in district doubles. In 2011, she was runner-up in district doubles and took runner-up honors in that year's state tournament and was elected as the state tournament's overall tournament competitor. This year, she was runner-up in district doubles and placed fourth in doubles in the state tournament. Chloe was selected all-conference in 2010, 11, and 13 
and earned all state honors for 2011 and 2013. Chloe's also filled the rest of her free time for the last five years as statistician for the Rebel Golf or Rebel Football sideline staff. Thank you, Chloe. Now the 2013 Rebel Cheerleaders. First off is Brianna Murphy. Brianna is out there with her mom, Becky Gore. She has been with the Rebel Cheer Squad five years. And she began cheerleading in the third grade with the Mighty Miners. Brianna's been a captain of the cheer squad for four years. She was voted most outstanding junior high cheerleader and has been selected as an all-American cheerleader. Congratulations, Brianna. <laughs> Kelly Chisholm. <laughs> Kelly is out there with her parents, Donna and, or I'm sorry, Steve and Christy Chisholm. She has been a rebel cheerleader for two years. Kelly was nominated for All-American Cheerleader Honors and is one of this year's captains. Congratulations, Kelly. Thank you. Amy Clay Thomas. Her parents are Renee Clay Circle and Nathan Circle. She's been with the Rebel Cheer Squad for three years and is one of this year's captains. She has been named an All-American Cheerleader two times. Congratulations, Amy, and thank you very much. Now the Rebel footballers and sideline staff. Number one is Cody O'Dell. Cody is a wide receiver and defensive back. His parents are Chad and Cheryl O'Dell. He has been in the Rebel football program for five years. Thank you, Cody. Number five is John Zeiger. John is a wide receiver and defensive back. His parents are Adam Zeiger and Kim Zeiger. He's been in the Rebel football program for three years. Thank you, John. Number seven, Cameron Seat. Cameron is a fullback and linebacker. His parents are Duncan and Julie Seat. He has been in the Rebel football program for six years. And a little story, when we credit the Highland Mighty Mike program with being the future of the Rebel football program, Cameron and his fellow senior Tyler DeLargy are living proof. They've been playing football in the Rebel program since third grade. Thank you. Number 22, Sean Young. Sean is a running back and outside linebacker. His parents are Angela and Russell Goodman. He's been with the Rebel football program for the past six years. Thank you, Sean. Number 55, Tyler DeLargy. Tyler is an offensive and defensive lineman. His parents are Nick and look Lenona DeLargy has been with the Rebel football program for the past six years. Thank you, Tyler. Number 56, Ted Woodson. Ted is an offensive and defensive lineman. His parents are Evan Richard Woodson. He's been with the Rebel football program for the past six years. And just a little note, uh, Ted is one of the last of the Woodson boys. Mom and Dad, we sure would like to have a few more Woodson boys come up, so if you could help us out just a little bit. They, they, have, been, they have been a joy to watch. Number 77, Nico Tremaine. Nico is an offensive and defensive lineman. His parents are Mark and Winter Leet. He's been with the Rebel football program for the past six years. 
Thank you very much, Nico. Now we have a trainer, Allison, Allie Kaufman. Allie has been a trainer with the Rebel football team for the past three years. Her parents are Mark Kaufman and Wanda Kaufman. Thank you, Allie. We have already introduced Maddie and Chloe. They are also sideline statisticians for the Rebels. Thank you very much, ladies. Now, we would like to tell you that we've had fun watching you through the years, working your way through the Rebel athletic programs. We've enjoyed watching you. You have all earned the right to call yourselves Highland Rebels. Thank you very much. Now, please, if the groups of the golfers, tennis, cheerleaders, and football players will get together out there for group pictures, we'd appreciate that.